Yo, what's going on everybody? This is Misko. I just finished streaming and I got asked about, you know, 9.2.5 changes that came out and apparently there were some misweaver buffs. I briefly saw them. So I just want to quickly talk about them and just, you know, kind of my thoughts about them. For the misweaver change, they decided to just reduce the cooldown on Zen Focus T from 45 seconds to 30 with the note that misweavers are having a difficult time responding to burst damage reliably as they regularly have to open their primary school in order to catch up. Giving them more access to interrupt protection is intended to let them respond to burst damage more reliably. I just, in my opinion, I just don't agree with that at all. I, I, I mean, I'll take it. I'll take the chain. I'll take the Zen Focus T buff, but I think the problem is, is not healing. I, it, the problem is everything else. We don't need healing. You know, I think we need some kind of utility, some kind of damage reduction, maybe an instant heal, you know? I mean, I, they say it right here because they have, you know, they have to open up their primary school in order to catch up. Give us an instant heal <laughs> would be, I would take, maybe it'd be cool if we had like a 45 second or a one minute cooldown that put our hots on somebody that they, and it couldn't be purged or, you know, something like that or a damage reduction on, on one of our spells. I mean, Zen Focus T is getting buffed, but again, there are some, a good amount of matchups where I don't take Zen Focus T. You know, Eminence Peace Weaver is really good. Zen Focus T is good versus mages, but Warlocks are just getting nerfed right now, right? Warlocks are getting nerfed, as well as the Resonator Trinket down here, or e Echoing Echoing Resolve Trinket. So we're not going to see as many Warlocks, which means we're going to use Zen Focus T into mages. But that that's it. I mean, we I use Disarm Chrysalis. Even Thunder's Focus T too. Zen Focus T I use versus Mage teams. And that's that's it. So essentially they're buffing something. I only use maybe 20% of the games. I, I, the problem with Mistweaver, and there's a few problems with Mistweaver. The first thing is we don't have a damage reduction. We don't have we don't have something to mitigate damage. Life Cocoon, even though it just got buffed, it still gets absolutely destroyed because there's no damage reduction built into it. And we don't have something like Diffuse Magic or Dampen Harm, Iron Bark, or something that we could use to kind of mitigate some damage. We don't have damage, period, which is another big thing, especially in twos where, you know, you'll see Holy Priest. The reason why Holy Priest and you'll see Resto Druids too, kind of at the higher part of the ladder is because they actually contribute to kills with damage. Uh, with Thorns or if they're Feral Affinity and then, you know, Holy Priest have Mind Games, Holy Fire that just does insane amounts of damage. So that's rough. And we don't have that. And then we have so many globals that we need to press. Um, if you're a Holy Priest and you leave crowd control, instantly you press Holy Word Serenity, boom. You know, 50k heal. You know, in instantly. Um, even Resto Druids, you, you can, you know, they have Hots up, they can Swift Mend, they can NS. We have Life Cocoon on 2 minute cooldown. Um, but if we leave CC, we, we want to heal. I have to use Soothing Mist, and I got to Vivify, and then, okay, one stack of Cloud of Focus is enough. I got to use a second global. And then that's not even counting Renewing Mist if I have to. So that's three globals minimum just to get some decent healing out. And that's the problem with Mistweaver is there, there's so many GCDs just to simply heal. That That's... I just want to heal. I just want to heal my teammate. So, like, I got to use Renewing Mist. And I got to use a second global. And then I got to use a third global. So, it takes three, four globals just to get any healing out. That That's the problem with Mistweaver. It's not Zen Focus D. If I'm going to be quite honest with you, this developer note about Mistweaver makes it so clear that they just don't play Mistweaver. I, I, I just don't see how you could play a Mistweaver and, and think that this is a good change. I... I really don't like, and I'm sure like they probably had meetings about it and like what changes to make, but out of every spell that Mistweaver has, Zen Focus T was probably the last one I would up. I mean, I would add a, you know, damage reduction to Life Cocoon, damage reduction to Revival or something, make Yulon the uh, enveloping breath that we have, maybe make that a damage reduction instead of making a whole nother hot. You know, more healing. Maybe make it a damage reduction. That way, before I get put into crowd control, if I put hots up, I get rewarded by putting hots up a damage reduction up before getting put into crowd control. As far as Mistweaver goes, I don't think much is going to change. I think that we're still going to be the worst healer. Zen Focus T again, not that impactful. 15 seconds doesn't even change that much. I, I, I think we'll have it for every other, every other go. But besides that, that's pretty much it. And then... 
We have no damage to kind of follow up and help with their team. Those are just some things. I listen. It just doesn't matter what I say. Anyone says because I know they they're probably not going to listen or do anything or reach out. So kind of frustrating because I feel like there's a lot of feedback on the monk forums from me, from other misweavers everywhere, and we're we're just uh, kind of a pity buff if you want to call it. So. Yeah, that's kind of what I think. It kind of sucks. The other thing that kind of buffs Mistweaver, by the way, is this right here. They buffed the set bonus from the stamina increase from 350 to 500. So we're going to get more health, which means our life cocoon is going to heal for more. And that's pretty much it. Um, if you have any questions, please let me know. I am more than happy to answer any questions you might have. And that's it for me. I hope everyone's having a fantastic rest of your day. I hope you enjoyed the video. And I'll see you later.